What is up folks, we're kicking off this vlog. I am going to talk about through the day exactly how I'm going to lose a lot of weight very, very quickly. Just putting this vlog up there for anybody that is looking to lose weight extremely quickly, not the healthiest option, but it can work and it can be effective. First of all, I'm going to put up these three cans of monsters on the screen now. These were given to me by a friend that was over in America and I said I'll do like a taste test. I put these up on my Snapchat. If you don't have me on Snapchat, it's rice underscore lifestyle. And make sure and add because that's where I put most of my content on. So I'm going to start off with the the blue one. So I'm going to take a, take a test. It's like 10 o'clock in the morning and I need to kick to start my day. So here it goes. That's lovely. It tastes a lot. It's like a mixture between the white and the red can. That's good. That is good. I'm going to enjoy that. So, starting off this vlog, I have um, a couple of things to introduce to you. First of all, I'm going to go dive straight into it. I'm not going to talk about any macros, calories, or anything just yet because I want to let you know where I'm actually getting the advice from. I have never competed before. I've never went to a photo shoot before. I've never leaned down to less than 10% body fat before. I've never put my body through hell. So I contacted a man that I've worked with in the past called LS Results. And if you just want to check out the video that we've done before in the past, and I'll put it in the description box. He's a brilliant trainer and he's also very, very good at giving advice. And he has competed before, he's done photo shoots, he's done it all before. So he's given me some stuff to uh, put, put in place that will help me uh, get to as lean as I want to get over the next couple of weeks. So he's gonna he's been taking me on board. I've been talking to him nearly every day. He's telling me what to do, macros, calories, cardio. I explain everything in the video. So I'm currently weighing at 68 kg. As I said, I was never under I was never 67 or under before since last June. So I'm sure to hit that now in the next couple of days. I'm gonna keep the cardio going. I'll talk about what cardio I'm doing in full and what training I'm doing, my macros, my calories, all that crack. So see you the next one. We are back here. Did you like that little edit? I never did that before. I don't know if it actually worked. So I want to talk about my macronutrients and my proteins, my carbs, my fats, the situation on them. So I'm actually cooking up a storm now, so it makes sense for me to talk about my macros. You can probably hear it in the background. So my protein at the minute is roughly around 200 to 220 grams. My fats, I won't talk about carbohydrates yet, my fats are roughly around moderation, which is 50 to 60 grams of fat. And then this is where it gets a little bit complicated, which is carbohydrates. Now, my carbohydrates are only 80 grams. Yes, these are extremely, extremely low, and I will feel like shit, but it even gets worse. I'm not taking any carbohydrates through food. I am simply doing an intra-workout shake during my workouts which will be 80 grams of carbs. I'll actually show you the product I'm using. Boom, the Prolong Tropical Flavor and My Protein Intro Workout. If we fill this around the back, you'll see where are we carbohydrates. Two scoops, 75 grams. So that's roughly what I'm taking at the minute during my workout, having no carbohydrates in the morning, evening, before I go to bed, none whatsoever, which is having me feeling like shit. But it's getting me through my workout. So that's what I'm having my carbohydrates. Now, this is what I want to talk about my protein. Where am I getting my protein from? I have decided to absolutely chuck the, my, the protein shakes out the window. I've decided to throw out the protein bars. I've decided to throw out any powders, anything that does not literally breathe. I mean, eggs, salmon, uh, full of creatine. Fish is always something that you need in your diet. And if you don't get fish in your diet, make sure and please supplement in omega-3 fish oil tablets. I'm also getting steak, chicken, uh, basically anything protein wise, okay? I'm mixing it up because if you keep taking chicken for like eight weeks straight, you're gonna go insane. So I keep lighting to mix the protein up. As I said, I'm getting most of my advice from someone who I mentioned at the start of the video, which is the LS results. He was telling me, you know, uh, change up the protein source because if you keep eating the exact same protein source for a long period of time you will literally go insane so that's something that I'm doing the reason the pro why the protein is a lot higher than I usually take is because when you're trying to cut weight your body will go into a state of function where it want to eat into your muscle and you don't want to do that protein will allow you to keep as much muscle, muscle 
uh, as much muscle as possible. A general rule of thumb, in my opinion, if you're trying to bulk, you always go for 0.8 grams per pound of body weight. But if you're going to go for your cutting weight, then you'd always go for around 1.2 grams of protein per pound of body weight, per pound of body weight. That's kind of a general rule of thumb that I usually go by. Secondly, another thing I want to talk about is my workouts now. I've completely changed my workouts from strength program to endurance program, which means all my sets, all my reps, will be between 15 to 20 reps for shorter rest periods. Why? I do not have enough energy to get me through a strength program, even in a hypertrophy program. I can't do it. My body can't do it. So I'm changing up to high reps, splitting the weight in half. If I'm doing 100 kg bench press or, or squat, split it down, do 20 reps, three sets, of 60 kg burn the muscle as much as you can because that's all I can do at the minute because I'm on such low calories and such low energy at the minute so that's regarding the workouts that I'm doing next thing is and they talk about in this video is cardio the cardio that I am doing at the minute is LISS L -I -S -S, which stands for low intense steady state the difference between it and the HIT which is high intensity interval training is that in the list you're basically keeping your body temperature the exact same the whole time you're not going up and down your heart rate is not rising and then dropping rise and then dropping the list is basically a steady state but for longer periods of time the hit might actually only last for 15 minutes whereas the list will actually last for roughly about an hour so i'm doing an hour's cardio in the morning time preferably uh, fasted there's no benefits of fasted it's just the way i've actually started to do it i usually do my cardio fasted because i like to eat after cardio not beforehand because I get a stitch. This has been a really really short video and I just felt the need that I had to make this because I haven't actually went into the detail talking about my training, my nutrition and my cardio and my daily life around this photo shoot. So that's the exact macros I'm on, that's the exact cardio I'm on, that's all the stuff that you need to know how to lose fat extremely fast but this is not the best way. Preferably I would like to have had longer time, maybe 16 weeks to prepare for this photo shoot but the photo shoot has really just came around the corner really quick, it was like a last decision and I wanted to see if my body would be ready for it and if I could drop the pounds really really quick. As I said, I've never been leaner than 67kg so come the photo shoot I want to be 65 at least. And if I can get to 66 in the next week or so, I will document every single day. I'm videoing this on my iPhone 7. I actually think the video quality on this is very, very good. And it's very easier to pull out your phone and talk because it's as if you're talking to Snapchat. And it's a lot easier. So I'm really, really enjoying using the phone. Let me know in the comment box if the quality is still as good as it was or if I need to go back on the camera. I'd be massive and another thing if you haven't seen my giveaway for december for christmas it closes this week seriously get on it it's reached over a hundred thousand people there's over two thousand people involved between instagram and facebook if you take part on instagram and facebook you've a double chance of win so get on that quick because Usher mcconville has done a great favor for myself and give me loads of uh, previous gear from armad ga days and also cross plan so get on that and i'll pull a picture up on the screen now of uh, where you can find the competition and uh, take part and get sharing and get tagging it's going to be announced this saturday night uh, christmas eve it's something christmas is all about giving as well and that's something that i always want to uh, approach over the next couple of months and a massive uh, announcement on coming february so i can't wait to uh, get on board that and announce that so i've actually salmon uh, cooking at the minute so I'm going to show you is what that looks like uh, in the next in the next clip so here we have the like one of the last meals of the day this is something to give you a fair idea what I'm looking for no carbohydrates here I have my vegetables I have my two pieces of salmon and then I have um, I'll get a few here now just my chicken breast with herbs to mix it up to get some extra protein. That's roughly around 20 grams there. That's another, let's say, 35 to 40. And then I'll put the full macros up on the screen uh, at the minute, okay? So I'll just have a screenshot of the macros on it. That's something that is a lot of my meals are looking for. I might have this maybe three times a day um, along with my eggs at the morning. But I'm going to do a lot more of uh, daily vlogs coming up. This is something small to introduce you. To the way I am actually eating. 
Yeah, so that was kind of introducing you the way I'm eating at the minute, the way I'm training, the way I'm doing my cardio. So I will bring you along a lot more uh, during my workouts. Just at the minute, I'm feeling really, really sick today, so I couldn't be uh, bringing you to the gym. So I um, just want to get today over and start today for, uh, tomorrow fresh and get out of the heart again. So as I said, thank you so much to anybody that took part in the Facebook competition. It means a lot to me. And... It, <sighs> The response from everything this Christmas has been amazing. I would never have thought this um, a year ago. A year ago, I was probably sitting in a pub, full drunk, where now I'm um, trying to make something of myself. So, and I wouldn't be able to do it without you, the people watching this, you right now. So, thank you. I keep us updated on my weight and everything on Snapchat. Add me on Snapchat, follow me on Instagram, follow my Facebook page too. I'm starting to use that a lot more. And even my Twitter as well. I'm starting to tweet stuff that actually is kind of interesting. So... I'm getting out of here, I'm going to eat my feed, I'm going to lay up, I'm going to watch Liverpool against Everton. By the time you watch this video, the result is probably going to be up. Um, I was hoping Lukaku made it back to first goal. But, right, right, see you out of here. Thank you. Cheers. See you tomorrow.